by wonderful people uh, the insecurity in your uh, land uh, as Igbo's excuse for beginning a uh, urban nation agitation uh, is unjustifiable uh, either justifiable or unjustifiable i wouldn't know but as it is the headline which says uh, urban agitation or agitator is unjustifiable in the light of the new year celebration a uh, sunday at the MO, uh, a popular urban nation agitator has released uh, his 2022 um, new year message uh, with vital revelations to what has uh, inspired his agitations he started his uh, message by alleging that he was not at war with the federal government of uh, Nigeria, uh, the president or the state uh, governors. As it is, uh, Sunday Go uh, overtly uh, revealed what he termed the genesis of his uh, agitation for a Yoruba nation. In his message, uh, he claimed that uh, the genesis of his uh, secession agenda uh, was the insecurity level in uh, Ibarapa land and other locations uh, in Yoruba land also. He expressed that uh, innocent farmers, uh, yes, innocent farmers uh, were maimed, hacked to death and uh, kidnapped by criminal headsmen in Yoruba land. He further called on the government uh, to put an end uh, to killings and uh, kidnappings in the southwest uh, uh, this year, 2022. Uh, while I justify his right for peaceful protest, I totally condemn the fact that uh, he had to begin uh, yes, as it is, he had uh, to begin Yoruba nation agitation because of the insecurity level uh, in Yoruba land. Uh, from my own uh, perspective or from my own uh, judgment, mm, I would say uh, what the termed what he termed uh, the genesis of his agitation is uh, indeed either justifiable or unjustifiable or unjustifiable. Yoruba land uh, has been a path and parcel of Nigeria right from the uh, pre-colonial era. Why will he? Uh, why will insecurity be a reason to uh, secede uh, from uh, the region, or uh, want to you know separate uh, from the uh, region uh, that is uh, uncalled for? Or rather, I would say yes. Even if uh, there is going to be uh, a secession, uh, it shouldn't be at this level. Uh, but notwithstanding, Sunday Igbo uh, still uh, will be justified. Uh, to some, he, his agitation is unjustifiable uh, just because uh, his approach, I, I wouldn't know. But uh, what are the approach he needed to have a, a tail or trail, uh, rather? Uh, so we should know uh, what uh, it's embedded uh, when it comes to uh, lives and properties. Uh, because the government of today, or let me say, uh, in a general sense, I would say, uh, the priority of uh, the government uh, to give a good governance one, and also uh, to secure the lives and properties of uh, its citizens. Because, uh, because it's their right. I would say it is the citizens uh, who voted uh, uh, them in into power, and if you neglect uh, the rights of it of the citizens uh, by providing uh, adequate uh, security and uh, you know securing their lives and properties, I would say uh, you are forfeit in that angle because uh, when they were you know casting their vote uh, for you, uh, you were there. You know, begging campaign, and uh, because the really meaning of a campaign is uh, when you are lobbying uh, for a position uh, as a politician, or when you are uh, begging the citizen to uh, please vote for me, and that's what it is. Uh, yes, uh, Ibo overly uh, revealed that uh, he uh, firmed uh, the genesis of his uh, agitation. Uh, well, uh, I would say he said uh, he further called on the government uh, to put an end uh, to the killings and kidnapping in Southwest uh, this uh, year, 2020, uh, 2022, rather, uh, because uh, in uh, the previous year, uh, 2021, uh, the government, you know, uh, never yielded to the cry of the people. And uh, uh, this uh, Marodia, uh, uh, this uh, Fulani uh, ex men or let me say uh, the, the, the militia who were hiding under uh, Fulani ex men to uh, perpetrate evil. Uh, while I justify his right uh, for peaceful protest, I totally condemn the fact that uh, he had to begin Yoruba nation ag agitation because of the insecurity level in Yoruba land. Uh, from my own uh, judgment or perspective, uh, what he termed the genesis of his ag agitation is indeed uh, either justifiable or unjustifiable. Uh, Yoruba land has been a part of uh, Nigeria and also the parcel uh, right from the uh, pre-colonial era. 
uh, why will insecurity be a, a reason to secede uh, the region well that's the question for all to answer uh, it is a uh, very paramount to comprehend that insecurity has been a general issue faced by every region across uh, the country by comparison, uh, I am sure that uh, the insecurity level in the southwest uh, region is one of the mildest in the country. Uh, I would say if you go to the north, ah, well, uh, if it was uh, excuse for secession was insecurity, uh, what then do you expect from the northeast and the northwest? Yes, that is a good question. Hmm. Yeah, uh, is it best to divide the country uh, because of insecurity? It is quite uh, unpatriotic to uh, do so. Well, uh, that's someone opinion do but i would say the fact remains the fact uh, if you have you know compared uh, the uh, state and the level of uh, insecurity uh, uh, in the land you will say yes at uh, the northern part you know i have uh, let me say have you uh, you rather say it's just scale you can't put it on a on a, on a scale of 10 or 100 because uh, you know uh, so many people thousands um, have been killed over twenty thousand uh, people have been killed in the uh, northeast either not east northwest or not south as in not in general i would say uh, the reason why the the, the so-called north and not uh, the gullible northern northern i'm not talking about the educated ones i mean the timid uh, northern because they do not know their left from the right they lack education and they do not value uh, their lives if they really value lives and they really value uh, 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 the entity i would say it because mm, let me just use it uh, the the child bearing as a, a one number one uh, just one yastic a typical northern uh, would you know give back to uh, 18 20 10 15 children uh, either from a woman or from two three wives and uh, they believe that uh, if they have many children that uh, they can help them to go uh, to help them in a farm is a wrong orientation and now the economy is uh, lopsided and uh, everything is turning upside down the buhari they even believe that could help them uh has turned deaf ears <laughs> and uh, you are now telling me hey they should protest how do they want to start where is the courage uh, there is fear uh, i would tell you that in a, a community of uh, like 1000 you hardly see uh, four rich people so if uh, I would tell you uh, that uh, the rich people who you know want to get more rich uh, using uh, uh, the, 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 the level of uh, understanding they have and uh, you know the allocation the government gives to them uh, they will pocket it they will give them 20 20 naira and they will appreciate it so they do not even know, you know uh, know their left from the right uh, so why do you want to compare uh, the Yoruba land uh, uh, to that of uh, the north uh, the northern and is out of uh, the contest and uh, that is what it is and his son who has been you know uh, said is is a yoruba activist he's an illiterate he's an illiterate but he's exposed you know things uh, he, and he has traveled wide he might not really go uh, he, might not, he might not really uh, have been to school uh, he understand english you know how to speak at least but english language is not his language but it could be an official language and he, he communicates so i will tell you uh, uh sunday Bobo is not an illiterate uh, going to school or not going to school does not make you educated or uh, thereabout your primary education and the secondary education should be uh, a, a, a foundation for you to be educated so let's you know leave that for another day uh, the north uh, have uh, faced more severe attacks from terrorists bandits unknown gunmen and lords mom yet their faith in a united nigeria has uh, remained uh, stronger no i will tell you uh, if they have the opportunity uh, the finance have uh, i will tell you they would have run yes that's where hey i'm gonna stop uh, let's you know check time and also comment and don't forget to share this news thanks for listening and god bless you